to this is Lantig with NYC Flows, and we are about to unbox my Katana Pro Friends. Now, let's see what's going on here. So, I already sprayed it a little bit, you know, with the anti woo. No disrespect to my Asian friends, just trying to be funny. Alright, so this thing. So, this frame. Believe it or not, this frame has been almost, I haven't been able to find it anywhere in the States, so I had to order this through Ali Express Shipping, some bootleg eBay, Asian eBay that actually turned out to be this shit, so I'll send the link, oh wow, I'm cutting this the wrong way. I've been cutting things since kindergarten, I still can't. Some people are just talented at these things, you know what I'm saying? So, on back to the box, unleash me! Alright, so, this is from AliExpress.com. Um, so, this is the Power Slide 255mm Pro Katana frame. I've wanted this frame since before when I wanted this case originally, and I had to go through Asia to find it, so I mean, you can do with that information what you will. Now, let's see. Oh, and they come wrapped up. Oh, shit. Oh, damn. Yo, them things is fire. So you see, you see, uh, power slide. The Evo should, the Evo should not come with anything else but a pro frame because, honestly, let's compare it. Hold on, let's look at this thing, bro. Like, look how beautifully machined this is. Now I will say it's kind of light. Let's compare it to something real quick. As compared to the uh, aluminum frame, so let's all right. So let's get these wheels out of here. Get these big girls out of here. This is what the skate looks like with the casted frame. Now, if we look at the casted frame compared to the compared to the casted frame compared to the pro frame, it's just, bro, in terms of machining, this thing just looks like the premium is what I would expect if it's the pro model so honestly according to some very few information that I found um, according to Ricardo that there is a difference Ricardo Lino there is a difference between the power transfer so that's something that I'll probably uh, do a little update on but um, honestly just the aesthetics alone for me uh, do it I just don't see um, that's not to shit on the casted frame. Excuse my French. That's not to shit on the casted frame. The casted frame is fantastic. But realistically, when it comes to, like, looks, man, let's not, let's not go there, but let's not go there. Even with the, uh, even with the axle bolts in there and the spacers, dude, bro. This is like a little bit heavier. May and not I don't even know, bro. Like this is that scientific Bill Stoppard style. Honestly, this seems lighter even with this on. Am I bugging? Bro, this is 
look at these things. I mean, and not, hey, hey, hey. If you got the budget for this, for the casted aluminum frame, all power to you. I could not for the life of me find this, like I said earlier. Um, and I just ended up buying the casted frame. The casted frame has served me well. Look at, there's absolutely very little wear on this thing. Like, literally the only nip I have was on this. And that was like, because I like try to stall onto a stairs. But with the Trinity, the only bad thing about Trinity, well... One of the bad things about Trinity is that the bolt is there, so like if you stall or anything, you're definitely gonna nip or scratch the bolt. Which I mean, it's not really designed for that, but it's durable because it was just a little nip on concrete, so check that out. So these are actually really good for the power transfer. I cannot speak for the Katana yet, but I will be doing an update on this, but just to look at the difference in quality, baby. Like, AliExpress.com I will share the link. Honestly, I would prefer to order from this side of the pond, from the Western Hemisphere, but hey, we don't really have access to inline skating uh, products, and I'm really trying to change that. So this is why I'm starting this YouTube page to do little reviews and things like this, um, and just to like have people have more information because. Inlining is amazing. Um, I just picked it up after many, many years without skating. Almost like, honestly, like 20 years without skating. And I'm like, you know what? Let me start doing this again because I just remember how much fun it is. So if you're looking for the casted or, alum or the uh, pro frame, hands down, the pro frame is just... Come on, guys. The pro frame is just beautiful. And I can't wait to mount it. So... If you're on a budget, the casted frame works fine. If you really, if you're gonna get a, come on, man. If you're gonna, come on, man. Look at this. Now look at that, right? And oh, it's right on my lap. <laughs> Stay off the reef. Let me check it out. Come on, bro. There's no. Look at the way this looks, bro. It looks like a premium skate, man. Okay. This just bumped the sexiness. Like this skate, I had it rated eight, eight point five. It's eight point five now with the katanas, and I'm gonna test the power transfer and everything. Uh, thank you. Comment, like, subscribe. This is Lantig with uh, Flow NYC. See ya.